Hello everyone and welcome back to another Raviel Plays Custom Robo Arena. We are continuing the story today. So... Yes, also yes, my rank is a bit higher than last time. Uh, there was a fight outside the school. I hadn't come, I hadn't walked into the school to do any of these fights, but there was a dude who will fight you multiple times outside of the school. So I was fighting him a bunch to get a bunch of stuff. Wanted to, wanted to get a bunch of cash, <clears throat> and wanted to get my rank up a bit. Didn't think I'd get it up that much, though. I did figure out a combo with... Ooh. Okay. His Robo, which is a Pike, I figured out a combo with. But hers... I haven't fought this one. Uh, with this combo yet. But, looks like I can even extend the combo. To two of the... Uh, boosted attacks. Because usually that's what I got off, was one. The dude also didn't seem that bright when it came to robo-battles, because she's done more damage than he ever could. Ooh. <laughs> no, you're not getting back up and getting more damage off on me. <laughs> Alrighty, so we got a win there. Eight stars and 390. That's uh, not bad, actually. So, we're up to 199, and this guy, I didn't fight him either. But, the dude's in front of the school now, so if we wanted to grind up our class, aka our rank, we'd have to do it inside the school now. Oop, looks like we gotta do a quick... Shine up of everything. You always gotta make sure your robo's clean. Because the dirt can actually affect your performance. I think. I don't know. They added it so well into this game that I never... Oh, man. Well... Yeah, he got a good shot. He took advantage of a downed opponent. That is uh, the best time. couldn't be downed until I got in the game. Nice. Not getting up. He did alright. Dude said he got his first robo, so that's actually pretty good. Uh, 11 stars. We're up to journeyman rank 2. Nice. Alright, so pretty much... Unless they are named characters, usually I don't talk to them. Okay. So normally we don't I don't talk to randoms. But I wanted to talk to a few randoms. That I was intending to turn left so I could go in the guy's room and check. <laughs> that was the weirdest thing I've ever done besides almost walking into the lady's room and getting stopped. The other reason is you 
sometimes you can get items, I think, from talking to random people. I don't remember. I know you can get random battles out of them. Commander's Band. I was trying to turn to talk to her. if there was a mini game with that room that would actually be kind of cool so you can go in the other classrooms and check them out but usually they don't have much that's why I don't oh hey well we'll check this classroom real quick And it looks like we got a classmate outside the classroom. Outside our classroom. Yeah, you not beating anybody, buddy. I'm gonna beat you up right now. Let's make sure our Gundam... I said Gundam. I meant custom Robo. Uh, make sure our Robo's good. Oh. Yeah, these, these big ones are hefty boys. They can take a lot of punishment. I think he's actually got the gun I want. I think that's the Gatling gun. He hasn't used it for me to be able to see what it does. The Gatling is the main one that I actually know. Looking at that, that's not the... That might be the Gatling that I want. Because that was a really good Gatling blast. That actually might be the Gatling gun that I'm wanting. Because the Gatling gun was always one of my favorites for winning. The Flame Gun will do good for now. Perfect. Nice. 231. All right, Liv and Dennis are here. Robo Center today. Sure. Okay, so telling me to take my seat. Teacher will come in. It's not Stubbs. Okay, so we don't always have the same teacher. Also, they tell us to get on our computers every day. It looks like and they look like laptops. So we could face that guy again, but no need. We've already fought him once. We're doing good. Sure. Sure. <laughs> I love that they put me in the lead and then it just walks me anyways. Gotta do some walking, and Liv's gonna f lead us there. Hey, it's the two guys from the morning that we're fighting. So this is the Robo Center. I think it automatically brings you inside. Train as much as you like. Yeah, I think it automatically brings you inside, but you can leave almost immediately. Because there is the part shop, and I want to go to the part shop. Oh no, I think you can't leave until afterwards. I think you do have to wait until after all the training's done. Tanya. Psst. 
Thanks, Dennis. Alright, here's my school ID. Oh, right, you now get your commander band, which is what that guy was talking about. Now I can buy parts at the school, too. So that means I can buy parts out this way, buy parts at the school. Diggy! I love that. Of course. Sure. So in order to, if I'm remembering correctly, in order to get to him, you have to fight, I think, three other commanders first. Basically practice. can't win today he's definitely going to lose tomorrow thanks Liv all right so we'll go against all three of them so she's got a Luna that is a different one and we've got a different stage this time different model she's using a dual pod a satellite and the formula legs the formula legs are increased running speed so that's one thing she's gonna be staying on the ground a lot I think mine are the high jump legs. Uh, for your cube, you usually want to see the red face, and you never want to see the opposite side, which is the feet facing up. Because if the feet are facing up, your head's in the ground and you're kind of stuck for a minute. It's more than likely that your opponent's going to get a shot off on you. She is keeping me at bay with them satellite pods. However, she got away from her satellite pods. Smart move. Immediately initiating a satellite pod upon wake up. That's a smart maneuver because then she can immediately get me in the blast radius. Smart moves all around. The AI is slightly a joke because this is meant to be kind of like custom, kind of like custom robot on the GameCube. This is where Harry brought us to that arena to practice. This is the same thing, but it's practice here. And to be honest, practice here. Okay, he's got a hurricane. He's got a different gun and standard legs. Okay, standard legs aren't bad to fight against. We're still good on our... I'm trying to remember what good cleaning the robo does. See, that's bad. We hit the blue. He's probably going to get a shot off. Oh, he backed off. That's actually really good for us. Right. So, hurricane models are really high jump models. They actually, I think, benefit the most from the extreme high jump legs that I get. And I think they also turn into vehicles when they do their dash attacks, or their dashes. Dude's actually doing pretty good for, yeah. While you're still in your refresher mode. Yep, he turns into a kind of a plane. While he's in refresher mode, hitting that triple attack is actually a good idea. I think he also gets a bit of a higher time in his refresh mode. 
We got eight more stars there. That's not bad. We're up to $98. That's not a bad amount of money. All right, so we're fighting this third dude. He's got a fogey. Okay, that thing is a small uh, fighter. He's also using the needle or uh, the needle arm gun. The needle arm gun's not bad, but it's also not too good. Come on. All right, we're on our side. He's on his head. This is great. Because we can get... See, uh, I think he did the X, his X maneuver there, which... Or, or he hit his needles. Either way, he hit us for a lot of damage. See, we're actually lower than he is right now, so this is actually a good challenge. He's got a twin bomb. His bomb's good. His pod is kind of lackluster. It was the needler. His needle arm is a really rough contender to work with. Or work against. Because it has a long range to deal with. He knows the strat is to get in close with the flare gun. See? That is actually still a good strat. Because that's still from Custom Robo, the Harry mentions. You can... If you beat someone out... Only got five stars from that. That's appropriate but yeah you if you only get five stars from or you only get if he beats you through the the blast he beats you that's normal yep dicky let's go he got that karate stance he's going for the jujitsu he's going for that judy chop he's got an oracle okay this is a thin gangly one he's also got a gatling gun I did notice we are needing to polish the robo though. So, let me just. There we go. A hole clean. Uh, the super cloth just makes it to where it's a bit easier to clean. Usually you only use those if it's like really caked in grime. All right, he got a side, we got the bottom, so we gotta really tap that button to get up before him. Yeah, he's got the gun I want. Yep, and that's why. You can hit them down quick, and you can pin them down for a second. The flare gun does similar. All right. Put the pods out there. Hit him with a bomb. Pods. Pods. We've been trying to go for the strat of not using the bods or bombs or pods. But we kind of need to use them, so. Whoo! I almost made it to where he probably was going to get some more shots off on me. Whew. That was actually really close. Time was a C, which is abysmal. Only got five stars out of it. But, I'll be able to fight non-named characters more and get more stars later. And more cash. I've got to look at what each of the shops have to see what I can afford currently. And see if there's also the... Uh, Mission battles. Certain conditions like special holoseums or limited customization. Scattered all over town and they'll explain the rules. A check mark is added to your checklist. Be one heck of a commander. 
halfway through. I actually don't remember ever completing that checklist. I might try to this uh, run. Robocup champ. Sure. Increase in Renegade Commanders. Oh, we've now got the... The band to be able to buy stuff. So now they're showing me the parts shop. Which is what I wanted to go to next anyways. <laughs> so we're going to check... Let's check the parts shop, see what they got. Drill afterburner. The afterburner is not bad. Needle is not bad, and the hornet is abysmal. <coughs> I don't think, besides the satellite pod, there's not really much here. There is the formula legs. And there are holoseums you can buy. To... It's looking like everything's cheap right now. So I'll go ahead and buy some new parts. We'll buy the afterburner and the drill gun. It's looking like the most expensive are the guns. So I think I'm going to just buy a few of these and then keep a bit of money so I can... Okay, so let's clean them up real quick. I know I only usually clean them up in battle, but... Uh, there is also the diorama shop, which is not bad. The drill gun's not bad. Uh, I think afterburner's not bad. Didn't buy any pods, did I? Nope, tomahawk's staying then. Reflection pod will stay because I didn't want any new pods. I wanted the formula legs because I do. The formula legs are actually pretty fast. Yeah, sure. I'm... Yes, I'm done shopping, Dennis. Let's go. So there is the diorama shop. It basically gives you a diorama um, it's a random diorama to be able to buy or to be able to look make your gun uh, robo look cool so let's see there's the main police station members of the police can get in there random people's houses that guy had a bunch of robos that were either destroyed or just straight up not working anymore this isn't the time to be wandering around <laughs> fine we'll head home sure we can hang at my place Mom, Dad, a brick company. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're introducing themselves. I'm surprised they don't have more chairs for when they have guests. I am. RoboCup tournament and join the International Police Corps. And joining the International Police Corps. Mm -hmm. 
Last year's Robocomp champion. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Dennis! Dennis just called live out on that. Your develop that that explains that they're developers. They work at Neobrain. That. Heart it's to try to fail. <laughs> Dennis. <laughs> Dennis, what does that make live? I think that slightly make <laughs> Dennis is a sidekick. What is live the love interest? Please no. Not, no, not talking about that right now, but eh, yeah, they're fun, yeah, they're passionate. Her last name is Trainer. I love that, don't stay up too late. You would figure parents would immediately say, well, don't go outside then. But it's like, nope, back outside. <gasps> really? There was someone up there that had a robo out. School gates closed, so I can't even check there. The only thing I can do is go into people's houses or go to the park. What's back here? Nothing. Hmm. Uh, stubs live well, I was checking the random houses because I'm like I'm pretty sure that Dennis and Stubbs probably don't have robos out to fight with right now alright well we'll head upstairs and get some shut eye before the next day be able to take it okay I will nope they gotta run so now I gotta be on my way too to head to school now if we look around there are more I think there's at least one or that guy's still there she's here again and I think we can get a super cloth from her I think there's something for doing this every day, so I am going to... I want... because it does say don't expect improvements quickly. But she gives you a super cloth every day for fighting her. So I am going to plan on fighting her every day to get a super cloth. We have the afterburner gun and a new pair of lugs we need to try out too. Oh yeah, that's why I don't use the afterburner gun that much. Alright.
because the afterburner gun is kind of duty. See, I got trapped in a corner because of it. I think I was standing on top of her for a second there. Yeah, see, I got trapped down to 488. Two ninety two. That's uh, lovely. Yeah, I got down to one eighty. That just seven stars still. I'm still gonna get that super cloth, but man. I think I got the super cloth. Hold on. I don't know how many I got. Well, I can check the garage and it should tell me. No, I only have one super cloth. Maybe she only gives me a new one after I use the first one. Either way, putting the flame gun back on. So there was this person up here that was out last night. So let's do their battle. The legs work fine. It's just the gun. I'm going to have to rely on the flame gun until I get the Gatling gun. I th think they got a side view. Man, that's got a bite. got a little damage there because I didn't I think if you get a perfect you can get like upwards of 21 stars from one of these early game battles and that's a lot honestly 11 stars and four hundred four dollars and fifty cents that's not bad Okay, so it looks like that person is just a repeat battle, similar to the guy behind the school. Uh, these are always the same parts until I think either you rank higher. No, because I'm not sure. I I not sure. S someone I saw someone's playthrough and they had those, so I'm not sure. But thank you everyone so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I uh, may have some more stuff uh, come next time. Because I'm going to probably fight this guy a bunch of times. So I may have some more uh, levels and more money. Or less money if I go buy some more parts. So thank you everyone for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.